Just follow the line as I move it across. That's it. Well, how am I meant to work with one eye? All the bouquets will be wonky. I won't see the customers coming. And, and what if a rose thorn Shh, gets a... I'm just <clears throat> checking in. Come to finish me off. Just want to make sure you're OK. Oh, do you hear that, TK? She cares about us, my maiming, and you're pulled back. Mum. Two lawsuits in less than an hour. <laughs> From what I can see... I'm blind. No, no, you have a small corneal abrasion. She thought I was faking. Is that bad? Well, it's superficial. Um, your eye's going to be a bit blurry for a day or two, but uh, we'll let it rest, and then we'll treat it with antibiotic ointment, OK? OK, so it's not serious. Well, all eye injuries are serious, but in this case, you make a full recovery. So, I'll get the script. Thanks, TK. Can I get you something, a smoothie, green tea? I think you've done enough. She can not stay away. You started it. She attacked me! Let's just focus on getting you right, yeah? Mm. Zen. <laughs> my foot. So, who's up for a walk? Oh, I am. Yeah, me too. Great. A new second-hand bookstore's opened up just down the road. Oh, books again? Yeah. Cece said she found a great Graham Greene novel. Did she? Right, well, I'm a bit over reading, so I might just stay here and cook dinner. OK. What about you, Smita? Um, yeah, yeah, I actually think I might be keen to stay back and help Dawn cook. Oh, you sure? Promise to make it fun. Didn't you hear Maddie? She wants to stay here and cook dinner with me. Text me if you find anything fun. Right. Okay. Mac and cheese. Yum. Mm. Okay. Mm. Hey, when's your break? Two for one muffins at the cafeteria. I have to work through. Well, you worked through last night too. Paperwork never stops. Oh, well, you can bring it along. I promise to not even talk. <laughs> like that would ever work. Yeah, just me, muffins and. Nothing. Oh, incoming. This is Kristen, 22, with acute abdominal pain. All vital signs normal. Ta. Hi, Kristen. I'm Marty, one of the doctors here. You reckon we can get you up onto this bed? That's it. All good? Yeah, thanks. So, let's hear more about this abdo pain. When did it first start? It's been wreaking her life for months. I'm Grace, her sister. Right. Well, that's no good. Anything make it feel any better or worse? Um, it's all here. What's this? We've made a record of all her symptoms over the last four months. All the doctors we've seen, all the people that don't believe us. Wow. Saying we're at the end of our tether would be an understatement. This is very comprehensive. So if one more person tells us it's all in her head or sends us packing with a useless pill... I believe you. Same. Thank you. So let's get to the bottom of this. Um, I would like to have a look and a bit of a feel around your tummy, if that's okay. And we'll book you into x-ray and see what's what. And we'll do some bloods. And let's start from the beginning and tell me everything you got. Any luck? Nothing. Bloods, urine screen, abdo x-ray, all normal. Nothing when I palpated. What am I missing? Maybe it's not physical? Well, she's been told it's all in her head more than once. She could be drug-seeking. Well, I thought that too, but... She doesn't strike me as a faker. Yeah, neither. OK, let's start over. Four months ago, she was moving house. She thought she pulled a muscle. The symptoms got steadily worse. So if it's not a muscle, it could be a nerve? True. Muscle pain, nerve pain, uh, cousins. What are you thinking? I'm thinking this could lead somewhere. Figured anything out? Not yet, but we could be on the way. I'd like to admit you overnight and run a few more tests. Leanne. Who's that? Oh, don't say a word. How are you, Leanne? How's your eye? Better, despite the pirate jokes. Look, I just wanted to say how sorry I am. I, the whole point of this yoga class, and, and in fact the whole wellness centre, is to find peace and... There I was, not doing that. I didn't exactly help, did I? Yeah, well, I shouldn't have reacted, and I'm sorry, and I bought you this. Oh. Organic. Of course. I meditated on it last night. Did you? Mm-hmm. You got me in the eye for a reason. Okay. I needed to look at things from a different angle. <laughs> my spirit isn't very subtle. So, instead of buying into all my hurt and anger, you rejecting me and Chris stopping my flyers, I, I took it as a chance to, just to, to, to lean in deeper. 
Right, and what did you find? That, although <laughs> you all think that I'm a silly old goose and pass no, my use by date, no. no, no, I have a, I have a wealth of contacts and community outside this little echo chamber, and I think I have a lot to offer. Well, I'm glad. And I wish you well with your new venture. <sighs> Who knows if it'll even happen? It's not exactly been smooth sailing. Oh, be careful what you think, Vivian. We're shaped by our thoughts, and eventually we become them. <laughs> Who told you that? Oh, just a wonderful, enlightened man I happen to love. His name's Buddha. <laughs> 